Tennessee's wins a 12 round unanimous decision over Shaq and Peters. School cards read 117, 112, 150, 113, 111. The two school cards, 117, 112, 117, 111, seem just about right. Um, you know, Tennessee's was able to close the distance, you know, quite quickly, quite easily. Um, while Shaq and Peters would just hold really and not really do much. You know, he wasn't really using his jab. Of a file of his height and reach at that weight division should. You know, he wasn't really using his jab. To be honest with you, he looked like he was just trying to hit down with these little uppercuts, which he did have success with, but a little bit Mr. Mark was just being blocked. Um, so yeah, for most of the fight, Dennis Hughes was just crying and shotgun players for not that actually the most cleanest shots really. Just basically teching his way on the inside when Shaq and Pierce would grab a hold of him. Not much really, clean, not much clean work in there, but at least you know Aziz was making you know uh, most of it. But later on, as the fight went on, Shaq and Peter started to time Aziz with the uppercut and started to have some success. Uh, but it was too little, too late. Uh, then Aziz won um, by a 12 round right decision. Not really a great fight. Some people say it was a great fight or a good fight, but mm, not really a good fight to be honest with you. But then Aziz wins over Shaq and Peter's 12 round right decision for. Um, uh, uh, British Board of Boxing uh, actually no no he was defending uh, his British Board of Boxing uh, control uh, lightweight title you know what I'm saying? anyways that's the first map. <laughs>